Hi, I'm Mark Evans and I'm an actor. It's freshly made pasta with the family in Frio. Mm, Dad, that's not paleo. A children's author. Get the Viking god on their side. The Viking god of all their shout <laughs> And a photographer. That's it, darling. Show us what you got. Oh, cheeky, like it. Oh, hang on. Stay still. Stay right there. Don't move. Oh, nice. And I have a love-hate relationship with social media. I love Facebook. I love sharing with my family and friends. But I hate all of the narcissism, all the people trying to sell you stuff all the time, uh, all of the, the negativity that's on there. You're just constantly hearing about how bad the world's becoming. And I see it amongst all my friends and, and family that it's really dragging them down, it drags me down. And I don't know how to fight it because uh, social media is here to stay. All my friends and colleagues are telling me that you're a photographer and you're not on Instagram. And you're a writer, you're not on Twitter. You're an actor and you're not on YouTube. How can you, you do that? So I thought I'd like you to try and experiment with me. I'm going to try and throw myself full on into these uh, platforms, into social media. But... I want to do something a bit different. You see, I believe in what Gandhi said, which is be the change you wish to see in the world. And I think that the world is like a big street and all of our, our houses and our, our gardens are like our social media platforms. They're not the real us and they're not what's going inside the house, but they're what we project out into the street, into our neighbors. But at the moment, everyone seems to be walking along the street and looking at everyone's garden saying, ha, ah, Mow your lawn, or, hey you, pull up those daisies. I hate daisies. Ah, look at your weeds. And instead, what I'd like to do, I think, see, you can change people through fear. You can. But I'd rather follow the teachings of Master Yoda. Fear leads to hate. Hate leads to anger. Anger leads to suffering. So let's avoid the suffering and avoid fear and make change through inspiration. So let's try this experiment. Let's build a beautiful garden, a garden that people come along and they go, wow, that's an amazing garden. Maybe I should mow my lawn or maybe I should put in some more flowers. I think that's how we make things better. So what I'm gonna do every day, come on this experiment with me. I'm gonna start up this little channel and I'll upload to all the platforms something inspirational every day. Uh, inspirational person or some uh, invention that's changing the world for the better or organizations that are doing incredible things so every day you come on and you look at your newsfeed and there's something from me that just lifts you up so what I'd ask you to do is to like or subscribe or do all the things that you have to do with the hearts or but most importantly pass it on to someone you love pass it on to even someone you don't. Just try and help them pick them up because you'll be surprised there are people out there that are really struggling and they're on their Facebook and they're on their, their Instagram and, and they're seeing these things that are bringing them down. So just share it with them. And here's my first example. There's this uh, great show on the ABC last year and they're showing it again. So if you missed it the first time, make sure you check it out. It's called Don't Stop the Music. And it's about a, a principal that brings music to a school that's really kind of doing it tough in a tough socio-economic area. Normally these kids would fall through the cracks, but what she's done is bought this a music program on steroids. You know, you've got Guy Sebastian, one of my teachers, amazing teacher, Hall is on there. And uh, they, they, they lift up the children through music. So check it out. All across Australia, too many children are missing out on the joy of music. Musically trained kids have brains that literally work better. But for these kids from the suburbs... Where are your school uniforms, boys? I want these kids not to have any disadvantage. All that's about to change. Children, more than anyone, need music. So, with a little hard work... When we're singing badly, it sounds like a cat's are dying. <laughs> and a big helping hand. Can you imagine some of my children with these? It's time to unleash. Shut everything else out and try and feel the song. The power of music in our schools. I'm so proud of you. Don't stop the music. Starts November 11, ABC and iView. That's pretty amazing stuff. 
So what I'd ask you to do is pass this on to anyone that you think is a, a, you know, a teacher or, or a parent or anyone who loves music or just someone who needs a bit of a pick-me-up. Just show them that there are people out there in the world who are doing their best to make it a better place. That's what I ask you to do. Pass it on and be the change. Stay tuned for more stuff.